According to Minister Poulier, over the last two years, approximately 31,000 eligible grade 12 students have been denied access to tertiary education, while the minister is focused on reducing this increasing number to ensuring all students have access to higher education, the quality of the education is also given a top priority. That's where innovation and quality comes in, but also accessibility to the universities to give them that quality education, but tie it to the market, the industry, so that the training that they get is relevant, so they do get a job. Remember the, our PNC LNG project? Uh, there was about 36,000 people that were employed, and all of them were from our friendly neighbors outside of Papua New Guinea. You know why? Because we had not trained our people in our technical colleges and vocational centers, so we had failed. Private institutions have also been increasing to cater for those students who could not secure a space through the formal education system. However, the quality of the courses offered in those institutions now remain a concern. The minister has tasked the new board of the National Higher Education and Technical Education to ensure courses offered are accredited and meet the national and international standards. Jobs we have. I have is to make sure we give a space to all these 31,000 that come in uh, to the uh, universities as well as to the colleges and uh, technical institutions. Uh, one of the issues that the board will be discussing is to find that accessibility. Um, or if they can assist within the policy framework that the chairman was referring to, he's talking about three or four policies of the education sector that they will be looking at as to how they can come in uh, within the context of the law, the Education the General Provisions Act. Uh, so we must give accessibility to students that come out of the schools at the higher education sector. Uh, we must give them quality education. Minister Polia also revealed that his ministry is focused on ensuring that all institutions provide quality higher and technical education to students that will guarantee employment going forward. Sharon Engnui, National MTV News.